Hey everybody, I hope you're really, really well. I am back again, two days on the run. Uh, I just thought I'd come and share a couple of thoughts with you about the coming summer, which uh, seems so, so far away since the snow was here just a few weeks ago, and the coming Christmas. You know, often uh, summer is a really poor trading period for business to business uh, because, you know, people go on holiday and things just grind to a halt. Um, that is common wherever you are, if you're in manufacturing, if you're in professional services, whatever kind of business world you're in, summer is a lull. And Christmas, the build up to Christmas can be a really exciting time because you have that high energy and then January, uh, you kind of, uh, <laughs> I was going to say something a bit more brutal, but you kind of lose the will uh, to live because January is so tough. Uh, that is often because we live in an economy that's quite cyclic. Uh, there are lulls, peaks and troughs, but uh, really strong businesses that perform well have a plan and a strategy in place to really weather those tough times and not just batten down the has hatches and hope for the best. They're, they're thinking about summer now. In fact, most businesses have planned uh, how they're going to cope with summer and they're thinking about how they harvest as much as possible in, in the Christmas period. That's generally how it works. So you need to be planning for that now. Now, if you don't have a plan, let me give you a couple of tips. Number one, don't react. Reaction tells you you must do something. It doesn't matter what it is, but you have to do something. You have to satisfy a little tick box inside yourself. That is not a way to implement a strategy. Number two, find the best strategy that works for the customers that you want. Don't copy somebody else. Do something that fits for you. Number three, make sure when you implement, you implement with full high energy. Put everything you've got into it. Uh, don't half-heartedly half do it. Don't cut corners. Make sure you've got everything you need to execute that plan, not kind of pull back and try and hedge your bets. You either go in or you go out. It's that, that simple. So number one, uh, make sure you've planned it and thought it through, no knee jerks. Number two, make sure it's the right thing that will work for your customers and it's the right comms that, for your customers. So don't don't do a Facebook campaign if your customers aren't on Facebook. <laughs> Simple stuff. Um, so design your campaigns and your marketing and your strategy around where your customers are, what's important to them, not what you want to say. And number three, um, you know, it's total common sense. Don't, <laughs> don't kind of give up or do, do it half measures. Go in and do what you need to do and get it done. Summer is coming up. If you need some help with your plans, drop me a line. I'd love to come and chat with you or we can have a Skype call and talk about what your plans are for summer, what your plans are for Christmas, what your plans are for January and what your plans are for the next year. So have an awesome day, guys, and I'll see you again soon.